Morning everyone. So we're going to look today at adding ly to words. So ly is something that we call a suffix and it's added to the end of words. So we're going to be during the lesson today changing the y which is a y to a new spelling rule which is adding ly. Okay it'll all make sense in a minute. So let's have a quick practice. So we can see on the screen that we've got this word soft. If we add ly the word becomes softly. Okay and this one quick if we add ly the word becomes quickly. Then we've got safe again if we add ly the word becomes safely. Now we've got the word rude. If we add ly, the word becomes rudely. Now we've got nice. If we add ly, the word becomes nicely. I'd like you now to pause the video and have a go at adding ly to these five words. Pause the video now. Okay, so remember the lesson from yesterday where we were talking about adverbs. So the adjective, the describing word, becomes an adverb and it tells you more about the verb. So here's an example. The tortoise walked. Now walked is a verb. And the tortoise walked very slowly. Slowly is an adverb. And you can see at the end of the word just here is our new spelling rule l y the tortoise walked very slowly okay so most adjectives add l y to make an adverb but not all adjectives okay so it's it's important to remember that it's not every single one so if an adjective ends in a Y, change it to LY. So you add an L before the Y. So an example, here we go. Secret. If we add LY, it becomes secretly. Okay. Whereas sleepy, if we add LY, we have to add a magic letter in between and then add ly so we get rid of the y and we change it to ly okay so try these i want you to pause the video and you are going to have a go at changing these words so if we have a look at this one what would it be i wonder have a go have a go at these six words take a picture of your work and see if you can impress me on class dojo pause the video okay everyone now that you've had a practice here is your challenge for today so on the screen there are five sentences so you need to write the sentences down on a piece of paper and put in the missing word so I've put the red words at the bottom. You need to decide which adverb fits into which sentence to make it make sense. Okay? Good luck. I look forward to seeing your pictures on Class Dojo. See you tomorrow.